ஹாய் ஹலோ குட் மார்னிங் வெல்கம் பேக் டு அவர் சோஷியல் ரிவிஜன் கிளாஸ் யா இன் அ ப்ரீவியஸ் கிளாஸ் வி ஹாவ் டிஸ்கஸ்ட் அபவுட் த மேப் பாயிண்டிங் இன் தேட் வி ஹாவ் டிஸ்கஸ்ட் அபவுட் தட் நைபரிங் கண்ட்ரிஸ் ஆஃப் இந்தியா அண்ட் பவுண்ட்ரிஸ் ஆஃப் இந்தியா அண்ட் ஸ்டேட்ஸ் அண்ட் கேபிட்டல்ஸ் ஆல்சோ டுடே வி ஆர் கோயிங் டு ரிவைஸ் த லெசன் நம்பர் ஃபோர் ஒர்க் ஷீட் லெட்ஸ் ஹாவ் லூ ஃபார் அசஸ்மெண்ட் டூ வாட் இஸ் த சிலபஸ் ஃபார் சோஷியல் லெசன் நம்பர் ஃபோர் ஃபைவ் அண்ட் செவன் I prepared one worksheet based on this fourth lesson. Once go through that. Students, this is a worksheet based on the lesson number 4. I love my India. Already for the first assessment, uh, we completed 1, 2 and 3 lessons and uh, the worksheets also know. We have revised. Yeah. Same like that. Lesson number 4. I prepared one worksheet. Once go through this and uh, I will send the pic. the both sides i have written the both sides worksheet okay just you have you have to write down these answers only answers in the hw book social hw book on just see the pic and write down the answers if you are interested write down each answer three times or two times otherwise write on one time only okay along with the worksheet after completed this answers just go through the notes also okay after completed this answers just go through your notes let's number just uh, we have to revise from states and capitals yes states and capitals and union territories and their capitals also and also revise this lesson question and answers lesson number 4 question and answers 1 2 3 4 questions they have given okay this you have to revise along with the worksheet okay let's have a look yeah just roman wise we have to write down the answers first roman matching i have given okay uh, tomorrow i will send a uh, today or tomorrow i will send a model paper or blueprint blueprint means model paper okay is it clear children just matching it's based on totally lesson number 4 what is the matching uh, always you have to read the right side what i said read the right side and match with left side is it clear children here only number should come only number should come in the brackets first one head of the country who is the head of the country here yes president he is the first person of the country and head of the country okay this is a matching nine what are there in nine yes it's union territories next head of the state who is the head of the state yes governor for our andhra pradesh are remaining uh, states and capital states also governor is the first person okay governor is the head of the state east what is there in the east side bay of bengal capital of india new delhi okay now come to the choose the correct answers these are also very easy when we when do we celebrate republic day when we are celebrating republic day on 26 january okay india is divided into smaller parts called what are those called countries or states or islands next india is the dash largest country in the world largest country that means seventh largest eighth largest second largest the union territories are governed by the the union territories are directly governed by the local government or central government or state government india became independent on dash 14 november or 5th september or 15th august in 1947 which is the correct answer you have to write down next right true or false okay india has one state government and many central governments once while you are writing true or false children once again you have to think again and again you have to think about the question first first true or false whether it is true that statement is true or false you have to find out don't write uh, immediately uh, whether it is true or false uh, you have to you are writing a uh, true if if the statement is wrong means you are writing true okay don't do like that just read that some uh, typical uh, sentence will be sentences will be there in this india has one state government and many central governments each true or false you have to read at least three times or four times then you have to attend the answer okay india is surrounded by three rivers next the prime minister of india lives and work in amravati the prime minister of india prime minister means he lives in new delhi is it related to amravati once check that pakistan is the neighboring country of india next india is divided into 29 states and 7 union territories is it correct or wrong 
mostly I'm saying how many states or countries divided and union territories also once go through that. Okay. Next come to the second part. Fill in the blanks. Our country lies in dash continent. Which continent? Whether it is in a European continent or Asian continent or Australian continent, whatever. Okay. India is surrounded by the dash ocean in the south. Which ocean lies in the south? The people of dash have the right to choose the government. How the people of dash have the right to choose the government. Okay. Next, dash is a, prest, a present chief minister of Andhra Pradesh. Who is the present chief minister of our Andhra Pradesh, our state? Okay. The person name you have to write down. A person whose age is dash years and above can vote in India. How many years? Okay. The president of India lives in the dash bhavan. Which bhavan he lives? It's given in the, everything is given in the textbook. Once go through the textbook also. Okay. Next. The offices of the central government are in dash. The central government, all the offices will be there in where it is. Okay. Dash is the present president of our country. Who is the present president of our country? Okay. Next. Write the capitals of the following and locate these in the political map of India. From the map book. From the map book, we have to tear one states and capitals map and write down. First, write down these answers in the homework book. Then, locate the same. Same 15 items I have given. Andhra Pradesh, Maharashtra, Nagaland, Andaman and Nicobar Islands, Rajasthan, Tamil Nadu, Bihar, Gujarat, Damanandu, Chhattisgarh, Punjab, Assam, Puducherry, Mizoram and West West. For these 15, you have to write down the states and you have to locate these in the political map of India. Two works you have to do. Here in the homework book, you have to write down the answers. At the same time, you have to point out these in the political map of India given in your map pointing book. States and capitals map. map. Okay. Is it clear children? Students, along with the worksheet, along with worksheet, you have to revise the this lesson, lesson number 4, question and answers also. Okay, is it clear? You have to write down these answers in the HW book. This is the revision for assessment 2. Okay, thank you. Have a wonderful day.